as I travel bold through a portal of my proportion. No, don't give me a proportion of happiness because I'm joyful, I'm full of gifts. Um, so my pencil shoot lead to the thoughts of my head that I led. I'm ahead of my brain, so what I say struck rain and a storm. I'ma dive clean into my art. I'ma dive clean into my art, seeing a beacon sparky beam in my heart. Then steam in the dark, the dark scene has been seen in a broad mist. Don't miss this part, tick cold breezes, releases smallest particle freezes. Yeah, I can't do this. Uh, This the first spot you would come to if you was to come to this homeless shelter. You know what I'm saying? Because it's just on your mind, like, I just want to get out. But you want to go out there in the city. This the good side of New Orleans, you know what I'm saying? Because, yeah. you know, we got, we got two different sides of it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So this is where the people, when they live in this shelter, sometimes they don't got nowhere to go. When you be painting, the picture, like, what be just going through your head? Like, you be like, why, why you be painting the picture? Because, you know, a lot of people just paint the um, It was good at first. Then, like, literally that same year, it started getting worse. They had, like, rodents, insects, like, stuff that ain't supposed to be inside the house. After we got evicted, I ain't had no else to go, so I slept under the bridge. <laughs> My teacher came and he brought me to the Covenant House. They gave me a place to lay my head, eat, you know, and stuff. You just, you go through your mind, you go through your feelings through art. Like, how do you do that? We looked at the one of the houses yesterday, right? Yeah. The last house did that did that work out for you? How is that going? Um, it's going good. All right. Yeah. So you, did you like it, or did you you think that's the one that you're gonna choose, or most likely, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, um, did you have room for your paints? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what? I I I really mean this when I say this. I've seen such a change in you from the first time you came to Covenant House to now. You know, you're more bolder. You're you're definitely more outspoken, and I've I've even seen your your artwork get better. Transitioning from Covenant House to your own place is a big step, right? You know, I hope that your space allows you to keep your vision growing, you know? Allow you to, to make changes in a way that you've already made changes um, with the residents here and with the staff. Allows you to keep on um, bringing things to light that might be in the dark that people never even think about. Because the truth is, Elijah, your, your purpose is, is for change. You know, you were put on this earth to make people think about things that they may not have even, even thought about.
to me, or it don't always have to be visual. It could be something much more than visuals, much more than vocals. Or this life. Or this life. Life is, is the canvas, and you only have one shot to create the best image you could create out of it. And it's up to you, the creator, to paint that image. When you wake up in the morning in your own bed, in your own house, you'll be starting over on a new journey of your life. What then? Each phase of your life, you're going to go through different traumas, different learning experience. The struggling part is the strokes of the paintbrush. Each stroke holds a emotion in it. And each one of the emotions expresses a different side of the artist. So it's up to you on how that painting will come out at the end. That's what I think home is. <laughs>